Hi, everybody. This is Vladimir Akuna, um, international best-selling author of the Bible of the Masterminds. And we have a beautiful Maria Stoyer here again, advising us on a weekend parenting advice. And she's an international best-selling author of the book Breaking Your Loyalty Contract, which is soon to be renamed. So, <laughs> Hi, Maria. Thank you so much for meeting us again. Hi, Vladi. Thank you for inviting me. Um, I have a parent of the couple who's asked me, well, I will try and explain it to you. So basically the father has a troubled childhood. So he went through a really troubled, the parents were on and off together and, um, and there were some shouting and issues um, and violence, but not too much, but you know, it was like, I think the father was alcoholic. So basically that's why to put it. And, um, what she was her his wife was asking me is there a um, reaction which we would do to our children when they do certain things so it stays you know how we talked about beliefs and limitations and basically what she said sometimes it's almost triggering the reaction to the child when they do something and they do not understand why because it's not their belief so they can almost feel that it's not what they would how they would love to react but they react like that anyway yeah, yeah. This, is, this is really normal because uh, the children are able to trigger your feelings from your childhood experiences and uh, this is uh, how she described the feeling. This is overwhelming. And when you have an overwhelming feeling, the first thing you should do, breathe in and breathe out and do not react. Because when our feeling from childhood is uh, triggered, then we act like uh, we first had this feeling. We act like maybe a child from eight years, mm -hmm. or maybe we, we act like our parents acted that time, but it's not, uh, uh, the reaction from from here and now, it's a reaction from the past. And the overwhelming feel always is an indicator, stop acting, breathe in, breathe out, and then make a reality, a reality check. So get clear about this is the feeling from the past and has nothing to do with the here and now. And what is really, uh, uh, um, what really um, does happen now and then uh, you can ask, so maybe something about the behavior of the child, or you can say, oh, I need a minute. Uh, these are old feelings in me now, and I need to have a rest and get this figured out. Just reflect. And the more you do it, you more are, are aware about these things. And you get, uh, uh, when you look at this, you will figure out, is this the feeling of power, no, powerlessness? To your parents or do you copy your parents and judge behavior mm -hmm. that you do not like or your parents didn't like mm -hmm. so this is really uh, a good uh, um, uh, uh, it was really good seeing that this overwhelming feeling is a trigger from old experience feelings and that you should stop at that time to get a reaction you want in the here and now and not go to the past and react from a feeling out of the past. Okay, basically. it's so funny because as you were talking, I just felt maybe, sh do you think it's a good idea to maybe start writing down when, yeah, you can, you when it actually, diary. and then she can try and see the pattern, what are the situations which triggers yeah. that? She can oh. write a diary and write down the behavior of the child and what feeling is triggered if this is the feeling as a child in relationship to her parents okay. or does it uh, remember her at uh, the reaction from the parents to her mm -hmm. and uh, and then make a diary and after a week she will find maybe something like a pattern in her reactions and then yeah come to my program and yes. figure it out. <laughs> I know you do and Maria really has a detailed problem so if there is you know some Maria can help you with because one answering one question is one well one step but if you want to really pull it through, it is really amazing program. I, I, I've i read it. I've read the work, workbook and I know a few people. And Maria has helped 20,000 families with, with the, as a therapist. But can I just ask you, Just I'm just sort of thinking instead of my friend, how would she know 
whether it's her feeling as a child or something that she copied from her parents? Can she tell? No, it's, it's, no, it's her feeling, you know, from the parents comes the judging and, uh, oh, okay. and about her behavior. And then they may be were violent to her or abusive or something like this. And the, the feeling, the experience of her feeling is what is triggered. Mm -hmm. and, and then maybe she has the same feeling against the behavior of her child and she is judging in the same way as her parent judged. Okay. Uh, you know, but by this, uh, uh, I, I think we need a little bit uh, conversation to figure uh, this yeah. out in detail. But, but uh, she will remember when she does the diary and then uh, she will find her way and see more clear what happens and then change it. Okay. okay. And changing is, I mean, joining you in the program, but is there some yeah. quick fit, quick fit? <laughs> yeah, but, but awareness is the first step. And yeah. then sometimes you, you can go uh, by yourself, go ahead by yourself. You do not need me. But uh, yeah, awareness is just the first step. Yeah. yeah, that is true, actually. Awareness is is noticing what you notice and writing it down is, is the best step to actually figure out what you want to do next. Thank you so much for your help. This is amazing okay. as You're always. You're welcome. <laughs> and I will see you next weekend. And yeah. thank you. And I will put uh, Maria's program in there. But if anyone seriously, you can, I'm sure you can join Maria for one session. She's running Q and A's where she actually answers more questions. And it's also important to listen to other parents because you can get so many questions answered by listening to other people's questions. So thank you okay. and we'll see you next weekend. Yeah, have a great weekend. Bye Vladi, take care. Bye Maria, thank you.